Hi everyone, this is Paris Tabono of the Fortune Teller Shop, and I'm going to do a reading for Ron DeSantis and Nikki Haley using my fortune telling game. So let's see Nikki Haley and Ron DeSantis. So the symbol that's going to be Nikki Haley will make the circle and Ron DeSantis will be the piece of wood. Okay, so they have to start at number one. So let's see who begins. So let's start with Nikki. So we're gonna roll the dice. Nikki needs a one to get started. So she's got a four. So Ron, one. So Ron gets a one straight away. So he starts and we put him on the sun. Now, when the person lands on the sun, it just means they're ready to begin the game. The sun says, you are ready to begin. Know thyself, see the light. So it's like this person's ready now to enter the board. Okay, so let's see how Nikki does. Six, so she can't enter yet. Wrong. And he's got a two. Okay, so the first, the first go, you have to start on the one. So one, two. So Ron has moved over to the moon. So it says here, life has light and dark. Which will you dwell in? So it's really telling him to look and see what he wants to bring to the world, light or dark. Then it says, roll even, move two spots forward or roll an odd and move one back. So let's see if he rolls an odd or an even. So he got an odd, so he got five. So he has to move back and he sits back on the sun. Okay, let's see if Nikki is going to move. So she got a three, so she's not ready to move. Now, just because the person isn't ready to move, that's not necessarily bad or good. It just means the state of play. Sometimes they catch up, sometimes they even overtake. So I don't put a lot of emphasis on who starts or who lingers, okay? So let's just go back to uh, Ron. One again. So Ron's got a one. So he's back to the moon. So that means we have to go do it again. And he's got an odd. So he's gone back. He's got a one again. So he's got... He's gone back. Okay, so let's go back to Nikki. Nikki's got a five. So let's go back to Ron. Ron's got a six. Okay, so finally now he's moving forward. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. So he's on the birds. So the birds is about networking, talking, communicating, uh, it actually says birds network, choices to make. Now there are three birds. So there's people talking and, you know, Twittering and networking, okay? So it even says Twitter, 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 gossip and news on there, okay? Now, once the person's done that, then it also says go to the fish. So we move his peg over to the fish card and now he's on plenty of opportunity and abundance. So because he's had some time to think about whether he wants to be in the dark or the light, once he's worked that out, he's gone over to communicate and then through communication, he starts to bring in opportunities. Okay, so now let's go back to Nikki, Nikki Haley. She's got a, looks like a four, so she can't move yet. Back to Ron. One, so she needs his one. So now Ron moves one forward. So he's landed on a jester. Now the jester says here, folly, love, go back to the previous fool or jester. So that means he has to go back to number five. Okay, because that's the previous jester. Okay, so a lot of back and forward for Ron. Sort of one step forward, one step back. Let's go to Nikki. Nikki's got a four, so Ron. 
he has got a five. So one, two, three, four, five. And then he got the jester again, so he has to go back. So basically this one means all that glitters is not gold. So he has to, you know, perhaps look and see what he wants to do in the sense that he shouldn't promise things that are fake or false. He needs to focus on what's real gold and what's not. So it, so the game is sort of really punishing him by making him go back and forward over the same ground. So this is kind of like the lesson he has to learn. So all that glitters is not gold. So that's possibly for him as well. Possibly he might think being the president is, you know, going to be fantastic, but it may not be as fantastic as what it looks to be. Okay. So let's go back to Nikki. Come on, Nikki, we've got to get her started. Five, no, wrong. Six. So he's one, two, three, four, five, six. So he's got to look into the mirror. So he's looking into the mirror now. So the game of life is a reflection of your actions. So he's going to get what he gives out. Then it says here, the only one you are always with is you. So you better have a good relationship. So it's really telling him to connect with himself. Back to Nikki. Three, no, back to Ron. Five. One two, three, four, five. So he's landed on a winning card, a winning space. So he's landed, he's landed on the treasure. You will win something of great value. So I think he'll go ahead quite strongly after all of this back and forward. He'll sort of move forward. So it says he got to be in it to win it. So that's probably him uh, announcing that he's going to be running for president. Luck is on your side. So he'll have a bit of a lucky sort of growth spurt, I think. Now let's go back to Nikki. She's sort of floundering. Let's see. Four. Back to Ron. Three. So one, two, and three. So he definitely has the ability to make a contract and unity so he can probably unite his party and unite uh, the usa and then it says here as well make a vow and keep it give your word and don't break it okay let's go back to nikki six no now ron now he can only move one space there's only one more space for him one possible space and he's got a two. So he's gonna he so he's basically finished his story. So we'll put him on the side there. Now we have to focus on Nikki. So let's see. So two, 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 six, three, two, two, six, four. One. Okay, she's finally got a one and it's sort of hanging on there that it was a one. So a reluctance to start, Nikki. So she starts on a one. So let's go. She's got a six. Okay, so she's entered the game. So the first one always starts on a one. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So she's landed now on the shield. The shield is about protecting herself, but it's also about courage. It says here, courage, love is for the brave. So something that she loves, she has to be brave and have courage to go after it. She has to forgive and heal and also protect herself. Okay, so now she's got a five. One, two, three four, five. So she, now she's landed on the mirror. So she has to really reflect on herself and what she wants and really get to know herself. The game of life is a reflection of your actions and she has to have a good relationship with herself to be true to herself. Okay, let's keep going. 
one. So she's moved up now to the stars. Okay. So it says here, follow your bliss. So she has to really do this because she wants to do it. Move to the butterfly in the garden. Okay. And then it says here, your hopes will guide you to your true destiny. And she's going to move over to the butterfly garden. Now, the butterfly garden can be good because it can be about meeting people, uh, having a following, more popularity. The negative could be that it, it could be fleeting. It may not be long lasting. Okay. Now, the difference between Nikki and Ron is Ron started straight off the gate, but he was sort of stuck on this side of the board. Whereas Nikki took a long time to get going, but she's sort of smooth sailing. She hasn't had any major uh, problems or dramas. You know, she sort of like skipped forward, skipped forward, and now she's skipped forward. So let's keep going. Let's see what's happening with her. So she's got a four. One, two, three, four. So she's landed on love. Romance, attraction, desire, intimacy, and affection. Put your heart into it. So I think if she can appeal to people, perhaps more of a caring, wise sort of leader, someone who's going to unite the country, that might be the best way she should handle this. I don't think she should get into a, a sort of like name-calling match with Donald Trump or with Ron or whoever. It seems like she needs to really reflect, come from a centre protect herself, um, communicate, follow what she really loves, um, win people over and show unity and support and love. Okay. So now she's got, basically she needs to get a one or a two. So she got a three. Okay. So that's it. So she's landed on the love number 18. So in summary, Nikki had has love and support. So she her role is to bring love into the race, into America, into the USA. But I don't think she's going to win because she didn't have any real winning cards. Ron, on the other hand, is there to bring unity, the ring. And he did have a winning card because he landed on the treasure so he definitely wins over her so i think she'll have uh she'll probably bring love into the race and support and people will kind of um i don't know admire her or like her she'll probably build her own following but i'm not really seeing nikki win here she just doesn't have the strong powerful cards that she would need to win. This is Paris de Bono of the Fortune Teller Shop.